This is my direct opinion, and I think I'm going to puke. Yeah, holy sh... I mean, uh, poop. The crap that's coming out of this guy's mouth. Some stupid high school kid who's been thrown in front of the limelight, prompted, and made the centerpiece of the anti-gun movement is just full of it. Listen to this hypocrite. He doesn't want us to have guns, but he wants his rights and everyone else's First Amendment rights, but he's against Second Amendment rights. One more about school. Uh, you mentioned your backpack. What do they do with your backpack? There were, I think after we come back from spring break, they're requiring all of us to have clear backpacks. I think one of the most important, one of the other important things to realize is many students want their privacy. There, there are many, um, for example, females at our school when they have when they go through their menstrual cycle, they don't, they don't want people to see their tampons and stuff. And I've, it, it, it's just, um, it's unnecessary. It's embarrassing for a lot of the students, and it makes them feel isolated and separated from the rest of American school culture, where they're having essentially their First Amendment rights infringed upon because. They can't freely wear whatever backpack they want, regardless of what it is. It has to be a clear backpack. What we should have is just more policies that make sure that these students are feeling safe and secure in their schools. So somebody needs to tie this hypocrite's tongue in a knot. He advocates for the First Amendment right, and yet he's advocating against the Second Amendment right. Well, we all know high school kids are influenced by whoever feeds him the most crap and he's being fed. This is my direct opinion. Subscribe if you want. Don't if you don't.